Good morning, everybody. It's time for the first Monday morning assembly of our new summer term. And how exciting, because today we've got children in classes all around school joining our assembly. It's very, very exciting. So welcome, everyone. I've got a few shout outs already um, from the people at home. So Maya says good morning to everybody and she misses us all. Uh, Maisie's logged on. Caleb says, good morning, everyone. Emily says, hi to Miss Marshall. Deanna says, hello, everyone. Raphael says, hello, everyone. I miss my friends and all my teachers. Stay safe. What kind messages. You are kind, kind children. Right. I think we are going to make a start on our certificates, although I'm not sure that I've got all of the grown-ups on, on the assembly yet. So we will, we'll do our best. OK, here we go. So... In nursery this week, from nursery from school, Mrs Cowgill, are you on the call? Don't think she's here. So Mrs Cowgill chose Frankie this week because Frankie has been a superstar. As always, Frankie is a superstar. Mrs Dixie, you have chosen Katie Lee this week. Yeah, I picked Katie Lee because she came back with a big smile on her face and she joined in with my my writing activity and then she wanted to do more writing. So we did some more writing um, and she's just taken part in everything in the classroom and she's been a pleasure to have there. Oh, amazing work. Well done, Katie Lee. It's good that we've got some great writers. Mrs Blades, who have you chosen this week? This week, Miss Bentley, I have chosen Lucas. Lucas came back to school with a huge smile last week and he's just not not stopped smiling since. Give everybody a big wave, Lucas. Yay! Yeah. Well done, Lucas. Good job. Do we have Miss Watson on the call? Yes, I'm here. <laughs> Hi, Miss Watson. Who have you chosen this week? I've chosen Alea this week. Unfortunately, she's not at school today, but she came back last week so grown up with a huge smile and she was just so happy to be back at school. Oh, that is good news. Well done, Alea. Miss Moran, you have chosen lo lovely, lovely Lucy. I have. I've chosen Lucy. Um, on her first day back at school, she was a little bit upset. Um, but However, she came in the next day beaming from ear to ear. So I'm pleased she's uh, happy. Happy to be back. And she's very proud. Look, she's very proud. And yes. her friends are all really pleased for her. That is good news. Well done, Lucy. Good job. Miss Levitt, you have chosen the lovely Alkione. I have. I have chosen Alkione this week. She has got her beautiful smile on as soon as you said her name. She came back. She was the first one in the classroom. And she came with such a beautiful smile and such a positive attitude and was really ready to get on with her learning. Oh, good job, Alkione. Well done. Woo! Uh, oh, who have we got next? Mr. Hall. Mr. Hall has chosen John Joe. Yay. Yeah, I've chosen John Joe just because he's come back really smiley, really chatty and just happy to be in school and ready to learn. He is really chatty. He's been asking me all about my books this morning, the books that I'm reading at home. Miss Marshall, I bet you'd be proud to hear that. Nothing from Miss Marshall. She's frozen somewhere. Sorry, Mrs. I'm nodding. You were nodding. So I've lost you because I'm... Yeah, yeah, sorry. I'm very happy. Good. Well, I mean, John Joe can tell you all about the next book he's reading, I'm sure. You'll have to have a conversation with him. Mrs. K, are you on this call? I don't think Mrs. K is on the call at the moment, but Mrs. K has chosen Alfie this week because Alfie has been an absolute superstar. He's been in school all week. He's been working really hard and making Mrs. K very smiley. So good job, Alfie. Mrs. Sutcliffe, you have chosen Maybe. I have chosen Maisie. She's done a fantastic job last week. Lots of discussion going on. She was fantastic with her answers. Always had a hand up. Wonderful. Give us a wave, Maisie. Where are you? There you are. Good job, Maisie. Well done. Miss McFarlane. Are you there? You are there. You have chosen Senna. Hi, yes, I chose Senna. Unfortunately, he's not here today. I know. Um, Oh, but he came in with such a big smile and a positive attitude on Wednesday and it was just great and it really cheered me up. Oh, good. I'm glad. And fingers crossed he'll be back in school tomorrow. I hope so. He's been, he's been doing a super job on the virtual classroom today. He said he didn't feel well enough to go into school, but he's still been doing extra work at home. Oh, that, well, that's good. At least he's doing his learning. Well done, Senna. Good job. Miss Patel, 
you have chosen Yasmin. Yeah. Oh, Miss Patel, it's all gone a bit wrong. You're frozen. You might have to put your reason in the chat. Miss Patel? I'm going to move on to another class and hopefully she'll come back to us. Miss Furness, you have chosen Joshua. Oh dear, Miss Furness, it's really quiet. Can you turn your volume up? Is that better? A little bit better. Speak right into the computer, Miss Furness. Make us chuckle. Oh, we can't hear you. I'm really sorry, Miss Furness. Would you be able to put it in the, in the chat for me? I think I can see Miss Patel, who has said that Yasmin hasn't been in England for a very long time, but last week she had a chat with her and she's used some brilliant English. She's doing really well. Well done, Yasmin. That is excellent. Good job. Um, in the virtual classrooms this week, I'll come back to you, Miss Furness, once you've done your chat. Oh, she's done it now. Let's do that. So Joshua was chosen because he's joined in with every class discussion and has brilliant ideas. Well, I'm not surprised about that because he is awesome. Welcome, Joshua. Good job. Mrs. Walton has been looking at the virtual learning for Key Stage 1. Are you there, Mrs. Walton? Yep, I'm here. Woohoo! So, Mrs. Walton, for year one, the virtual learners, you have chosen Zanetta. I have. Zanetta's worked really hard this week. I don't have many year one children on the virtual classroom, but Zanetta's doing a brilliant job using Doodle every day and completing all of the work. So, she's doing a fantastic job. Excellent work, Zanetta. It would be lovely. Oh, look! Jasmine boys and girls are giving you a clap, Zanetta. They're so happy for you. <laughs> well done. Wouldn't it be nice, Mrs. Walton, to get some more year one children, either in school or on the virtual learning? Definitely. I would love to see some more. I think so. Let's try really hard, children, to log on this week and get your learning done. Year two then, Miss, you've chosen Raphael. I have. So, Raphael sends us so many pictures of all his work that he's been doing. And it's not just one picture and a rushed piece of work he's spent ages doing the work and there's lots of different pictures showing me all the stages of his learning so it's really great to see the journey that he's on with his learning at home oh that's lovely well done Raphael I'm really pleased about that that's good now Miss Cater is in charge of the virtual learning for lower key stage two so Miss Cater can you hear me yep fabulous so Miss Cater for year three you have chosen princess Yep, I've chosen Princess this week because she's written me a brilliant diary entry about um, dragons invading a city and it was very exciting. Oh, I might like to read that, Miss. You'll have to email it over and I'll have a little look. That sounds very exciting, Princess. Miss Marshall, would you like to see that too? Definitely. I think so. And year four, Miss, you've chosen the lovely Naomi. Yep, I chose Naomi because last week we had um, a Google Hangout and she was really excited when she got on and she could see all her friends and she didn't stop smiling all the way through. It was lovely. Oh, that's nice. So it's nice, isn't it now, children, that we can all get together on Google Hangout. We might not all be in the same room, but at least we can still see each other. And hopefully that helps you to feel a little bit happier. So that is good. I'm really gl glad that Naomi's leading the way on that. Well done, Naomi. Miss Marshall, you are leading the virtual learning for Upper Key Stage 2. So for year five in the virtual world, you have chosen Svetlana. I have, and I've realised that I've done it wrong because she's in year six, but she's in Laurel. So I'm very sorry. But That's okay. You've chosen two year sixes. I have chosen two year sixes. Svetlana has just been doing a super job. Her mum emails every day with something she's been doing. And we've been doing some Google Hangouts as well. And it's lovely to see her big smiley face. And she talks to all of her friends. And she has a chat and she joins in. She's done some super maths this morning. And Miss Patel has just put in the chat now. Yay! She's very proud of Svetlana. Well done, Svetlana. And good celebrating, Miss Patel. Um, in year six, now this is a funny one because this person has come back to school today. You've chosen Adrius. I have, and I thought I could see him. 
He's been doing a great job at home. On Friday, he joined in the Wellbeing Challenge and made an amazing board game that looked like it would be a lot of fun to play. It looked very professional as well. I think it must it have did. taken a long time to make. And he's turned up this morning. He was a little bit mm, when he came in, but I think he's having a good time now. So I'm really happy to see him back in school. Good job. And hopefully we'll get some more year sixes back in school this week. Um, remember, you are able to come back to school, children, and we've got these desks all waiting for you. And um, we would love to see your smiley faces in the building. So reception and nursery virtual learning. Mrs. Dixie has chosen Darcy. Mrs. Dixie. Yeah, I, I've picked Darcy because before the holidays, she used to do every single thing that I sent to her. And then last week, she was in school and doing the virtual things as well, which made me really Oh, my sad. goodness. I bet she's yeah. shattered. She must I be. hope she had a good sleep this weekend. Mm -hmm. Good job, Darcy. Right. That is the end of our certificates for this week. So... It does take a little bit longer, but we will do it like that. We'll do the ones for the children in school and we'll do the ones for the children at home. So let's just go back to our shout outs now and see who else has joined us. Ooh, OK. Bethany says, good morning, everyone. Stefania says, hi, everyone. Jan says, good morning, everyone, with a big smiley face. Delio says the same. Good morning, everyone. Simon says the same and has given us a lot of emojis. Uh, the Brennan children would like to say a big hello to Mrs. Walton and the Bump and also to Miss McFarlane. They miss you all and thanks to everyone that's making school safe. Also, thank you, Miss Watson, for looking after Henley. Ellie Kim says hi. Um, Kyra says hi, Harry. <laughs> oh, is that because you're at home, Kyra, and Harry's in school? <laughs> Emily says hi. We've got an anonymous hi from someone. Naomi says morning. Sim says hi. We've got lots of shout outs this morning. It's lovely to hear from you children. I hope you're all working hard. Please do remember to tell your friends to log on to the virtual classroom and to come and join the virtual assemblies and the hangouts. Or if they are able, if they're in one of our year groups that can come to school, tell them to maybe try coming to school if they would like to. Because children, are you all having a nice time in school? Give me a thumbs up if you are. Oh, everybody's frozen. I can't see any thumbs up. They did have sausage sandwiches and jelly on Friday. So I think that was very exciting. Right. I think, oh, we've just got one more, two more hellos. We've got a hello from Senna. We've got a hello from Lily. She says, hi, everyone. So I'm going to go now. Grown-ups, I hope you have a great day in the virtual world. Grown-ups and children, I hope you have a great day in your classrooms. And I shall see you all soon. Big wave. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Bye.